Alright, I am not gonna need these. I don't wanna know what I actually look like. Hey you, my name is Thomas Tom Scott Ridgewell, and welcome back to content! Now this may surprise you, given how incredibly good looking I am at any given time, but I do not often wear makeup for the occasional party, film shoot, photo shoot, yes, but it's always applied to me by other people. Meaning I have no knowledge or ability to apply makeup to myself. So I thought it was time that that changed. That I learned the ways of the makeup. But I'm gonna need some makeup first, aren't I? So let's pretend that this clip that I filmed two days ago is right now. Doopy 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 doop. Ow, fuck. Time to get beautiful. Where do we begin? Skin brightening foundation. That's me. There's, there's testers. This is pretty bright. I'm pretty white. This seems safe. Okay. Oh god, there's so much. Oil free concealer. Aha! Ha ha! Well, my wrist Show is me your wrist. Mental. Oh god. Eyeshadow toppers, which implies there's eyeshadow bottoms as well. Fantastic. Don't point at the ones you clearly want me to buy <laughs> so you can have later. It is shiny though. Oh, that is really pretty. I know, I'm not. Oh, <laughs> have you got Have you got a look in mind? Like, Honestly, just something that would make people vomit if they saw me. Oh my god, no! These are glittery ones. Yeah, they are. Okay, I like this colour. Okay, so this we'll is pop that in. Holographic eyeshadow toppers. What do you mean it's colour changing? What does that mean? But it's green! <laughs> what is this hog dick bullshit? Yeah, that'll work. I'll go with this one. I want to plump your pal. That seems like a threat. Okay, this is going to bring all the boys to the yard. Oh, shit. Hey, my brows are definitely thick and unruly, so this is the product for me. How the fuck are you supposed to tell the difference between any of these mascaras? They just, they're all black. Well, if my options are black or black, I'm gonna go ultra black. Wait, what? You gotta use brushes as well? I gotta get some lashes. I wanna be Cheryl. What am I doing? Oh no. Wow, I'm back and with a hundred pounds worth of makeup. This shit is really expensive. Now to be clear, I have not asked for any help or guidance with this. I've been watching no tutorials. I have not asked what any of these products are. I have bought these things and I'm gonna be applying them based exclusively on what I think I know from having watched Girlfriends and having overheard beauty video thingies. So yes, this is gonna go really well. Thanks for asking. Well, it's a good job I'm not wearing any glasses because I don't know what I'm looking at. All right, so the first thing we have here is a primer. Primer. I assume this is the first thing we put on because it has prime in the name, which is like first. I don't know how much of this goes on. Let's assume a lot. Oh, is that the right amount? Gotta put that lid back on. I wanna be my girlfriend and ruin the floor in my bedroom. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I assume this goes everywhere. Ow, ow, ow. This is why I only put aftershave on my chest. Okay, I think my face is primed. Primed and ready. I need a towel. <laughs> I'm gonna use this piece of merch. Mind turtle, your day has come. Now it's time for foundation. I'm using <laughs> Rimmel Wake Me Up. I think I saw an ex-girlfriend use this once. SPF 20. Oh, it, it's gonna stop me from burning. I wish it could stop the burning sensation I'm already feeling. I have no, I have no reference to, I'm just gonna shoot it on my face. All right, let me just put a little bit there. <laughs> put a little bit. Put a little bit there. Yeah, that seems right. I'll put some on my forehead. I assume that, again, foundation is the next step because we've primed my face and now we must found it. So, here we go. Wow. 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 This is not going well. Oh, God. Did I use too much? Is it the wrong color? I don't know. You're supposed to get it in your eyes, right? Ooh, okay, that burns a bit. Like, I'm gonna assume that I'm also supposed to do my ears. Like, girls put makeup on their ears, right? All right, okay, okay. What the fuck do I do now? Okay, I have brightening creamy concealer. So I have a lot of acne, as I said, for a 28-year-old man. Just dab that on there. Okay, yeah. No, this is definitely uh, working and doesn't look stupid at all. You know, I've, I'm honestly finding that slapping it is working better than rubbing it with my fingers. Okay, actually that hurts. I don't want to do that anymore. You know what? The spot is slightly less visible. So now we have so many other things and I pick these up vaguely knowing what they are, but not what order they're supposed to go in. So I have some Master Sculpt contouring palette, some invisible setting powder. I can see it, so it's failed there. And some Master Holographic highlighter. Okay, so this is contour and highlighter. So I got some brushes. Let's assume that it's this really big one. Dab, 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 dab. That's gone really thick, hasn't it? I'm gonna use a smaller brush. I'm gonna use a smaller brush. Where are my cheekbones? There it is. Okay, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go here. Guys, be honest with me. Am I doing a really good job? Oh, <laughs> it's dust. Now I feel like I'm beginning to blackface. Okay, one side is like quite clearly defined and this side is a fucking mess. I think it's safe to say I've done a really good job. Now how, how do they wipe off the brushes? Do they just slap it? They just slap the brush. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 
gotta slap that brush, baby. Gotta slap that brush all over your titties. Then you're gonna have some contoured titties. What? All right, now it's time for the highlighter. So what I assume you do is you put the highlighter either side of the stuff you've contoured. That looks like it kind of makes sense. Okay. I'm really going in thick with this. I'm not gonna fuck about. Although I'm not going for drag makeup because that's so advanced that people who are capable of doing drag makeup scare me. Like not through any inherently homophobic or misogynistic reasons, but that's that's a skill that I, I fear. The solution I think is always to put more makeup on. My girlfriend thinks she's gonna get any of this makeup when we're done. She is mistaken. I'm gonna double dip the shit out of this. So now, the only thing I can assume you're supposed to do here is big brush. Gotta blend it all in, you know? Is that right? Uh, who am I asking? Who am I asking this to? I feel like everything I just did, I completely undid. Okay, yeah, cool. That's fine. That's fine. You know what I'm doing this for? I'm doing this for all of the f fallen soldiers out there, okay? Because you kids these days, you don't know how good you have it, okay? You got your YouTubes, right? Where you just go bleepity bloopity blap, and then fucking anyone out there across the whole world will be like, here's how you do this fucking look, here's how you do these million different looks, here's how you, up you, you contour, you highlight, you apply foundation like a, like a, like a normal person. But you know what? Before YouTube, you were just fucked. You would just go into your mum's room, borrow her makeup, and then just paint yourself like a fucking clown. I remember going to school and just all the little teenage girls were just mimes. Just little mimes and clowns, just with their faces all fucked up. And you know what? I'm doing this for them. Because this is what they had to go through, okay? I'm doing this for them. I don't know how you clean these brushes. Probably with water. So now, it's time for the holographic, prismatic... Highlighter. All right, so this one looks fun. I like this. It's shiny. Ah, oh, my cheeks are shiny now. You know what? I take it all back. Boom makeup is really easy. Now people highlight their nose, right? They just do that. Okay, so we have setting powder now. I haven't found a use for egg yet, so I'm gonna just hit the egg with the powder and then just... Oh wow, that really fucked that up. Jesus. Just gonna hit, just gonna hit my face with the egg. Just got an egg on your face. This feels like it's undoing everything, and I've really fucked up. Okay, guys, I've successfully egg-faced. That's the term, right? Okay, what are we doing next? What are we doing next? We have so many things left. So many fucking things! I'm gonna do my brows. So I, I found this thing called a, a tattoo brow, and I assume this is to, like, make my brows more defined or, like, straight. Uh, I think it was for unruly brows, which I definitely have. I don't know what this is gonna do. I, I don't know if this is for people who have shaved their eyebrows off, but let's find out. Going well so far. Nope, okay, that I've drawn that on my face. I guess all of it's on my face, really. This feels wrong. I feel like I'm doing something very wrong. I'm doing everything wrong. Who am I kidding? See, the goal here isn't to create a ridiculous look, but, like, to actually create something possible, because I think that's the bigger challenge. Like, I think anyone could just be like, Bleh! Haha, <laughs> I look funny. But I want to see if I can get through this. I want to at least be at the level of a 14-year-old that's, like, just trying to figure out makeup. No one can tame these brows, baby. Frowning makes it a lot easier to, to locate the brows. Okay, you know what? I've done a great job. Done a great job, and I look like Noel Gallagher. Guys! Charlie stole my fucking eyeliner! Don't trust women's. They'll steal your, your makeup. Okay, well, fuck it then. Who needs eyeliner? I'll just go in straight for the mascara. Boosh. Done. How do you do this? How do I see where I'm going? Ow. 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 Guys, you know what I've realized I've forgotten? Quite an important thing. Makeup wipes. Yeah, this is just my day now. Cool. Operation Mascara was a big success, so... <laughs> however it is now all over my face. So you know what that means? It's egg time. Egg, 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 egg. It's time for the lips. Now I know what you're thinking. Tom, you don't have any lips. That's fair. Dry my lips off. <laughs> okay, we have this uh, lip... Lip liner... Pencil... Thing. So I assume this is used to line... Hear me out. The lips? Doesn't the lipstick go on first and then you line it afterwards? Do you reckon? But what if I'm like, you know, how you have to stay inside the lines when you're colouring in? It's like I'm giving myself lines to stay in. Alright, you know what, Eddie? I'm gonna trust you. And if it goes wrong, it's it's your fault. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Big, big moment for me, big moment for me. Look at those luscious beauties. Now for the non-existent top lip. This is the fun bit. Oh. Should I overexceed my lips? Let's try it. I have a top lip. Woo. Okay, I'll be the first one. I think I did a pretty good job with the bottom lip, but the top lip really went to hell. And you know what we do when we when we make a mistake? We get the concealer out. What mistake? What fuck up? Do you reckon I can just put concealer over the year 2013? All right, okay. So now that the lips have been done, now I assume we use this lip liner? It broke off on my face. 
just immediately. Can I be real with you guys? I feel like I'm just drawing a little mustache on my face. You know what? Could have gone a lot worse. I think it looks great. And that's what counts. Gonna be the bell of the ball. Jimmy's gonna ask me to prom. He's gonna finger me behind the bleachers. It's gonna be a magical night. Right, what's next? Eyeshadow! So I'm using Barry, another Barry M thing, holographic eyeshadow topper. And it is a color. That is nice. Oh, that's so much. Oh, that's so much, guys. Oh, fuck. That was a lot more than I thought it was gonna be. What doesn't kill us makes us beautiful. All right, you know, yep. I'm getting strong, like, 13-year-old in 2005 vibes. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. The eyeshadow has gone wrong. Ah! All right, it's time for, I think, the final step in this look. And that is knife to pry out these fake nails. Hey, nail, what do you, what do you think of my makeup? I think it's really good. <gasps> you fake nails. <laughs> All right, so I have glue. Here we, here we go. Here we go. More glue is required. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> I have power. Do you reckon you can use too much nail glue? <laughs> hell yeah. I feel good. Mm. I want to fuck someone up now. I feel powerful. Oh, but if I grab a titty, it'll pop. How do I do the other hand? This is difficult. Get on there, you big slut. I have glued my finger to my other finger. Yeah, that's really stuck. <laughs> ah! Son of a fudge. I feel like I should have done the nails first, just to add a whole new level to this video. Oh no, my lipstick! Oh no, my glue! Oh no, my nail! Last one. This is getting... Oh, fuck! I lost a nail. Oh, fuck. Yes! Finally! This is a great color, to be fair. Any woman wearing this has my heart. Because she'll have fucking ripped it out of my chest. Oh, fuck you, Eddie! Don't tell me it clashes with my eyeshadow now! Where were you when I needed you, huh? Where were you? You were nowhere to be found. Ooh, it's better with, with, with this on. Yeah! I think we're done. I think we're done. Oh! Okay, so... This is my look. It's a fresh look, and now it's time to take it on the town. Come on, lads. Let's go get lunch. Woo! <laughs> Whew. Well, this was fun. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Tom Scott, out. Hey you, just a casual reminder that I'm going to be at MCM Comic Con Manchester this weekend with Elliot here. So if you're in and around MCM, I mean Manchester, come by, come fuck my ass. Come by. <laughs> <laughs> come on by and say hi. We're going to make the effort so you should too. Okay, bye. <laughs>